one more thought. So do I really want to put a bunch of idols in Jerusalem and um, even put a Chinese idol there, um, the the monkey god, and I was going to have the monkey god um, taking Lao Tzu, Lao Tzu, that's the name, Lao Tzu, Lao Tzu, taking his fruit and um, the, the fruit that gives him a mortal life because the... Because that that scene happened in heaven, where the, the where monkey was stealing Lao Tzu's fruit, and so I, I think if Jerusalem is heaven, then it'd be great to have that depicted there. But I would like other uh, things, like I would like Jesus um, teaching children. Um, I, I don't know, I, and I, and like I said, I do I do want a throne bed in the do in the Dome of the Rock, so that whenever I want to. Okay, do I need a throne bed in the Dome Dome of the Rock? Someday, no matter what, I, I mean, I still believe that someday I will have a throne bed in the Dome of the Rock, as crazy as it sounds, um, just because I can. Um, so that's the thing. You have to understand, it's crazy how, um, like, I feel like there are a lot of people that are like, he's crazy, he's not crazy, he's he like, but it's, it's weird how it'd be really hard to convince me that I'm not going to have a throne bed in the Dome of the Rock. Someday, um, and that's the thing about how Jerusalem was actually built by us, and other people claim Jerusalem, and they don't even understand their own religion, and so um, I feel like it's pretty tough having an, an American president that says that sort of thing, and so um, I, I, I don't think most most Americans fully understand what I'm saying, but what I'm saying is. Um, I'm going to make Jerusalem my form of heaven and it's like, and, and you can still come there and you're still welcome there. And the reason that I want um, to depict the monkey king or the, the monkey who uh, was humbled by Buddha for so long until um, he reached enlightenment because the because hum Buddha humbled him so much, which um, my life is being humbled. And I, if there's anything I can relate to, it's, it's the monkey king's story. Because uh, I, I am the monkey king. I screw up. Um, but it's weird because I'm actually the bear. Um, but but I, I, I'm that kind of person, though. At least that's how I like to see myself. That's how I like to be. Um, so um, that's why I want to have it there. And also because I want to say um, this is a place for everyone. Um, Jerusalem's for everyone. And so um, not just the Muslims are welcome there because they're still welcome there. Uh, you can even tour the Dome of the Rock when I'm not on my throne bed. Why do I want a throne bed? Because I don't want to sit on a throne. I don't want people to be like, come, come talk to me on my throne. No, no I want to go bow, chicka, bow wow on my throne. <laughs> that's, that's the plan, is to get freaky on my throne. Um, anyways, so will we actually do what I was planning with Church of Holy Sepulchre? Um, maybe. I'll think about it. I, I feel like... I feel like uh, that's the problem. I wanted a sex dungeon in the Church of Holy, Sep Holy Sepulcher. This this is something I have to be honest about if I'm running for president, and um, because it, it's like it's it's the type of building that has has a sex dungeon, and uh, I created this religion. I, I I feel like I wrote multiple versions of the Bible, or I very much contributed in multiple versions versions of the Bible, um, and um, I feel like um, we have been tormented by this religion enough that. Um, if we want, we should be able to have uh, a sex dungeon in the Church of Holy Sepulcher. And so um, I'm mentally ill. <laughs> so that's the thing. I don't care if you vote for me for president. You have you have a choice. You've got Donald Trump and then you have Joe Biden. And Joe Biden's the guy that is the sane one. 